Does it stop being? Sí. Pastor Maximo, uh, how did you become a Methodist? ¿Cómo llegaste a ser metodista? Desde mi niñez, um, yo perdí a mis papás, a mi mamá y a mi madre. Vivía hasta mis siete años. Perdí a mis tres, tres años, a mis padres. Y a partir de eso, hasta mis siete años, viví con mi abuelita. Ella me ha criado. Y murió mi abuela. He said that uh, when he was uh, three years old, his mother died, also his pa father. Then he, he was living with uh, his uh, grandmother, but when he was uh, seven years old, his grandmother died. Let him tell story. Then, his Y murió mi abuela y tenía que enfrentar la vida solo. When his grandmother died, he needed to confront the life alone. He lived, he confronted life alone, alone. from se at what age? Que, uh, seven. seven. Seven years old. In that space, he visited a day a pastor and he showed me a picture of the paradise of God. At the time, one pastor visited me and showed to him a picture of the paradise of God. At the time, one pastor visited me and showed to him the picture. The kingdom of God picture. Y yo quería estar en ese lugar. I wanted to to be in that kingdom of God. Y yo le preguntaba cómo puedo llegar a ese lugar. Y I el asked pastor, it to that pastor how I can I can find how I can live in that kingdom of God. El pastor me dijo tienes que ir a la iglesia. The pastor said to me that you need to go to one church. Aceptar a Jesús. Uh, accept to Jesus and you can agree to that part. That's why I started to, to go to Methodist Church. And then, how did, did the church help you? Uh, how did you... How? Uh, después que se murió mi abuela, tenía que irme a Santa Cruz, a Monte. Yeah, when his grandmother died, he went to other areas, Santa Cruz region. Montero. 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 Y ahí fue que busqué la iglesia para que ellos me puedan ayudar. I, I looked for Methodist Church in Montero uh, because he didn't have nothing, but the Methodist Church helped to him providing uh, one small house in Montero. Y, y la iglesia me dio un cuartito para que yo pueda vivir. The church gave me a small house uh, to, to, to live, live in. in. Wow. Yeah. wow. Y todas las hermanas mayores de la iglesia eran mi mamá y los hermanos mayores eran mi papá. Yeah, he said that all the the oldest members of the Dutch church uh, was his father mother. and all the... Uh, all the women were his mother. His mother. <laughs> yeah, wow. In that church in Montero. And so then you grew up in the church and then you went to school? Después, así estudiaste en el colegio, ¿cómo estudiaste? Trabajé en albañil para en el día. Y en la noche estudié en el colegio. At the time I, I learned to work in the in the in the day, uh -huh. I work it. In the night, I studied in the school. Okay, okay. And then, when you finished your high school studies, <coughs> you decide. Why did you decide to become a pastor then? Cuando terminaste tu escuela secundaria, ¿por qué decidiste qué decidiste estudiar? Cuando terminé el colegio. Encontré la ayuda de unos hermanos menonitas. Ellos me becaron para un estudio en la Universidad de Cochabamba y fue que estudié técnico en maquinaria agrícola. Uh, first of all, after the finish my secondary school, I studied uh, the, in, the, in, in, the, in one university. 
because another church, Menonita's church, helped to him with one scholarship. For one year? He studied, he studied in that university. At the, like a technical, machine technical. Okay. Yeah. 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 Y saliendo trabajé en eso. Then he worked as technic in some, some business. Uh -huh. Y ahí fue que me di cuenta que la iglesia me necesitaba a mí. In, in, at the time I think it, I believe that Methodist Church needed to him. En mi trabajo ganaba mucha plata. In, in, in the first job, he uh, ran it. He made a lot of money. A lot of money. Y cuando decidí ser, a estudiar pastor, una persona me dijo, ¿Por qué vas a estudiar ser pastor? ¿Quieres vivir pobre? Yeah, when he decided to study as pastor theology, one man said to him, you, you are not right, because who studied theology is to be poor people. <laughs> How, how much were you making when you were uh, as a machine yeah, technician? Cuando estaba gan cuan ¿Cuánto estabas ganando cuando trabajabas como técnico en esas maquinarias? Mínimo a la semana sacaba 500 dólares. Yeah, mínimo. He worked. Work. Yeah, worked. Uh -huh. Each month, uh, uh, 500 dollars approximately. Each, each, each week. Each week. Each week? Each, each week. 2,000 dollars a month. Yeah. And you make <laughs> three yeah. to 400 dollars a month yeah. now. Yeah. What a sacrifice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, Pastor Maximo, um, um, you, um, you are, uh, it, your story is amazing. Yeah, your story is interesting. Thank you. But you need to, to know, yeah, in the human way, human way we are poor, yeah, right? But in the spiritual way, we are very rich. We know that God has our premium gifts, a big, big, a big gift Gift. for us. Uh -huh. Of course, we don't have much money in, in this land, but we believe in the future we will have big money. a lot of uh, money, a lot of gifts. Thank you. Bye thank bye. you. Thank you. Uh, you yeah? todo ese trabajo. But I, I renounced of the, that job. Y decidí trabajar exclusivamente en la iglesia. I decided to work full time in, as pastor. Entonces me fui a La Paz. That's he came to La Paz. Y fue, estudié allá y también me conseguí. <laughs> yeah, I studied two careers, theology and law. <laughs> estaba and finally... Yeah. It's you're here. Yeah. You're here. Oh, thank you. Thank you very He's much. He's a lucky man. Yeah, uh, go.